Rick, what an incredible way to go into the round of eight for A.J. Allmendinger, a win for the Dinger here at the Roval. Again, his third straight, as you just mentioned a moment ago, holds up the number one to the fans here. Gets the checkered flag. Waving to the fans. And he gives it to a young man wearing an A.J. Allmendinger t-shirt. How about that? That's good timing, isn't it? What was your thought when that caution came out with a handful of laps to go and you had a nine second lead? I knew it was coming out. Like it wasn't it wasn't gonna go go simple like that. Um, that was uh that was a fight today. You know, we just um, we had to be kind of on defense early, worrying about the points. Uh, and this this place was tough to pass. The track was really slick to begin with, obviously with all the rain. So I uh, can't thank all the men and women at Call Racing enough. Matt Call and Chris Rice. Uh, the type Rice Chevy, once it got in the lead, was stupid fast. So, uh, God, I love having everybody back. <laughs> like, like, you all are what makes this so much fun. So it's, uh, I'm just proud of everybody at Call Grayson. You know, the big picture's a uh, championship, but get another win. Three in a row, row here at the Roval. Uh, that's, uh, it means the world to me. Thank you. So. Everybody, Leaf Filter Gutter Protection, Leaf Home Solutions, Ellsworth Advisors, Nutrient Ag Solutions, uh, Celsius, can't thank ECR and Chevy enough, uh, Xfinity for, for allowing us to do this. So this was uh, what an awesome day. Boy, they survived everything, including the car stumbling, coming to the white flag. A.J. Ullman, your third straight win at the Roval.